Hello guys, thanks a lot for tuning in once again. I am here on my local landing site and I have here my paraglider already laid out because I would like to share with you my way of packing my paraglider and maybe an easy way for you as well to pack it and to save room in your packing bag. But before I start the video, if you are new to my channel, please make sure to subscribe, hit the like button and hit as well the notification bell. Look how many grasshoppers I have on the paraglider here. Let's pack the wing. The first step after you landed is to lay your glider as you see here. After that, you have to take one riser to make sure that the lines are not tangled nor twisted. What you want to do is to put the lines on your paraglider and place both risers in the middle of it at the end of the trailing edge. Laying the lines untangled on my wing helped me a lot to have no stress untangling them on the launch site right before the next flight. That's how it should look like. This V-shaped form shows you exactly the middle. A quick look over it and we're good to go. Once your lines are untangled, lift one riser and pull its lines closer and closer to you until you bring one side of the paraglider around the middle. Repeat on the other side. Personally, I find this method easy and efficient. Don't worry, dragging the glider slowly through the grass won't damage it at all. The next step is to start folding the glider. Make sure you start from the middle. You can fold first the right or left side, that's just up to you. It's very important to fold it cell by cell. You shouldn't fold it like a carpet if you love your wing and you want to enjoy it for a long time. Here you can see the rigid rods that are sewn inside the material. They are a very important part of the leading edge. Each one has to be folded on top of the next one. Avoid bending them. Just fold them like an accordion and while you do so, Try to pull slightly towards you because that's going to be helpful at the end when you will have to fold the whole paraglider. I used to move from the leading edge down to the trailing edge to give it shape first and then I move back to the leading edge slowly pressing on the glider for the air to come out of the cell openings. If I see that it's possible to fold the side one more time, I pay first attention to the rods in the leading edge to not get bent and after that I fold it again. If you follow the instructions so far, you should end up with two narrow glider halves. It looks good. Everything is there where it's supposed to be. Next, you need to start at the trailing edge, folding both sides together. Starting from the back will allow you to push the remaining air out of the paraglider while you are folding it towards the leading edge. Don't forget to pack the risers in the small bag because that will reduce the friction of the metal and other hard parts of the risers on the glider's material. While folding the wing in its final step, make sure to gently press on the material for the air to come out. Don't hurry.
Following this packing method will help you to reduce the packing size of your paraglider and therefore have more room in your bag for other items as well. It is very easy to close the zippers and you won't have to struggle anymore in doing so. There is plenty room to carry my GoPros, the Vario, the helmet, a thin jacket, a bottle of water or some other items with me. This was the easiest way that I would consider being because it's working quick and it's efficient. I am going to leave you now with this time lapse of how you can as well pack your paraglider but at the end of the day you have the same result. So now you also saw this way to pack the glider. Of course there are different ways you can choose your own, but I personally think that these two ways are the easiest ones and the most efficient ones. I hope this video was helpful and you could take some advice from me and if you did so, please don't forget to drop me a like and subscribe to my channel, I would appreciate it. So stay safe, fly with passion, see you in the next one, bye!